Hey people, welcome to this tool is. Today we're gonna be looking at the Vampire Tools line. Here I got a couple of um of tools that I purchased from them. And we're gonna be taking a look at this um linesman pliers. This is um made to take off screws that are damaged, that are rusted, that are rounded, whatever um hard to um, take off screws and um, we're gonna be taking a look at it so here it goes inside the jaws as you can see you have ridges that go horizontal and diagonal to give you um, a good grip on the screw and that's on both sides so therefore you'll be able to um, twist off any screw that's hard to get. These are the eight inch um, linesman pliers and um, they feel pretty good. It feels like the, like they go all the way down because only the bottom has a little bit of flex, but as far as the handles, they feel nice and nice and um, tight. So um, they also have a, a little uh, wire cutter blade right here so you can um, use it to uh, strip off some wire or whatever or cut wire and the other one we have today is going to be the scissors and um, these are interesting because they have a lot of, uh, a few different functions they have of course the you know regular scissor cut they have a little serrated area right here. They also have a flat part here. Um, they also have a wire stripper part here. And then here, it has almost like a box cutter. It's like a blade. Let's try that one out. As you see, it, it does cut. I never seen one that did that, so that's interesting. I mean, it's not the sharpest, but it'll get a package open or whatever. There are uh, these are six and a one quarter inch, and they also come with this um, guard so that the blades stay nice and sharp. They feel a little bit flimsy, like. I wouldn't really want to buy these over again because if I'm correct, these were like $30 and uh, the linesmiths were like 40 or 45. The linesmith players look like they'll do a good job, you know, getting out the screws. Uh, I would buy these over again if I had to. And, um, but the scissors, I mean, I haven't tried them, so I can't really say, but from first glance, I don't feel like they're worth the money. But only time will tell. So that's a little quick look at the vamp Vampire Tools line. So um, you guys can make your own decision and if um, you want to buy any of these products. Well, I'm gone for now. You do what you do, and I'll see you on the next one.